Well, Leeds were beaten by Bradford on Friday. It was a third consecutive defeat for the Rhinos, but you got back to winning ways in some style, didn't you, Jamie? Did, yeah, it was, uh, it's been a tough sort of period, but the lads uh, wanted to go out and they wanted to defend well, first of all. And obviously, I mentioned before about the, the comedy of errors uh, early on in the game, and they, they showed up real tough. And, you know, it was a washout score in the end, but you can't take anything away from a defensive effort. They had to put a lot in there and, uh, and really work hard for what they got. And, um, some real good skill at the end, uh, just turned out quite a few great tries. Uh, Ryan all being on the front of it, you know, whether he's got a run over the top of somebody or pick a ball out of the air and use some great skill, absolutely fantastic. And uh, just back up again, you know, practice makes perfect with this, this sort of thing. Any young kid's watching you know, um, all the skill that you've seen um, in, in some of his build up tries, he's just through practicing hard. And, and how key to have Rob Barrow back for you? Yeah, massive. Um, we've really missed him. We've missed, obviously, Danny Maguire. And, we had bent my belt for a little while and when you've got key players like that who are, who are so dangerous it, it can take its toll and just having Rob coming out of darting out of dummy half you know, and getting the ball at first receiver and taking the line on makes a huge difference and it's not always in that goes through either. And, um, and this you know. we should point out you're not about to see a replay, this one goes down yeah. and this, this is one you must practice because here we go again. That's it and uh, Kev practicing them kicks again and again and again, Ryan all that jump, his timing you know, his catch and to catch it off your chest as well is just unbelievable and these sort of things win your games in the end and just builds confidence that obviously snowballs. How disappointed are you in London at the moment? Uh, London aren't doing things all that great. Obviously they've been on the back of a couple of absolute hidings. The only thing I can say that is positive for them at this point in time is the fact that the majority of the tries have been scored on the edge of the field. So that means that their, their, their middle defence is actually being quite strong. Leeds moved the ball quite a lot in this game. and obviously This, this try shows off the defending as well, doesn't it? This one classic from Hardacre. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this isn't a great example of um, how to defend, to be honest. This is when uh, they, they say the old uh, defense runs around this field. That's not actually doing the job that you want it to do. But again, leads are having to move the move the ball or kick the ball. So the only positive that I can really take from it is actually no one's going straight through the middle of their pack. But obviously, their systems on the edge defense need to need to be improved. Jamie, when are you going to be back? Well, as soon as possible, I'll go see the surgeon uh, a week today, actually, and see what he says. And uh, once he gives me the Oakley, I'll go ripping in. You know, my knee feels great, man. It feels like it does every Sunday morning, which is a little bit thick. But um, I'm just keen to get back running, doing a lot of cycling, and just try to keep ahead of the game so that I've got too much um, fitness to get back once uh, he gives me the Oakley. Well, fingers crossed you're back soon. So the